it, uh, the Mississippi Chiropractic Association stepped up in a big way, and I appreciate it. You know, we've had tons of folks uh, that have endorsed us uh, since then and in, pre in, in subsequent elections, but to get that first endorsement was so important and to come from a group, uh, and you know what type of impact you have, but it really is about relationships. And for me back home, it was those that were chiropractors uh, embraced me, made me feel welcome. Uh, they helped me, we became friends. And also in the practice of law, I had uh, many uh, clients who had been uh, hurt. And, and to be quite honest, they, you know, they never really got any relief until they went to see the chiropractor. And so I, I had a great experience professionally of saying, well, look, why don't you go see this person? Uh, and they would come back a couple of months later and say, man, thanks. You know, so we know the work you do does make a difference. It helps people. But having those relationships is very important. And, I, and, and just for an inside deal to kind of leave you with, with something, uh, we, have, we get literally thousands of emails per week into our office. The ones that my email address, it shows up, if you send it there, it goes into the pile. And unless it's something really unusual, I may not see it. But every handwritten note comes to me, and I read that. So I would encourage you, uh, if you meet with a member, send them, a, or if you meet with a staffer, it's always better to send a short handwritten note saying, I enjoyed meeting with you, appreciate what you're doing for the chiropractors. Uh, and that will be read and, uh, and make a difference. Uh, but back home, get to know your member of Congress. Tell them you're interested in these issues.